I've been out in the cold a couple times. I mean, Days yeah. Let Me Go. Stephen had left in uh, like 91 or something like that. And so I was there for a year. And then I was pretty idealistic at the time and wanted them to commit that they were going to write true to my character. I wasn't going to, I wasn't going to resign, you know, like that's out, <laughs> that's out the window. Right. But um, <laughs> those days are gone. Yeah. But I was kind of <laughs> devastated because I thought I'd be there kind of forever. And so, but they were all good things. And it actually was Jane Elliott when, um, when um, Shelly Curtis called me to say, I have a part for you on General Hospital. Amazing. And I thought, I, I don't know, Days is my home, and I don't know. And it was Jane Elliott that called me and said, do it. It's going to be fun. And I'm so glad I did because it was so different for me. And, so, and I met so many great people. And, when when so, you said so, GH was a clean set, did you mean that literally or metaphorically? I mean, truthfully, like the floors are polished and okay. dusted. That's a but I'm, also, I'm not going to say which place is not, but I yes. also think, sure. Yeah. It's a clean, it's a very clean soundstage. Yes. I went to, I, we even did a, um, what was the name of it? It was, I want to be a soap star or some kind of show that my, yes. I did. I was a judge with that. And even we shot it there. And I, it, I was just reminded how polished the floors are. How <laughs> You're so funny. Fit. So when you were on GH, who, you played cat was it Catherine, Catherine Bell? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Catherine. Yeah. So who did you pri who'd you work with primarily there? Um well uh um Lynn Herring. Oh, geez. oh Lynn, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Lynn yeah. Herring was my nemesis and we were always, you know Oh, uh, okay. So who was know. the love interest? Um it was John York for a long time. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. Johnny York, yeah. And um and that really adorable guy, the artist with the mm -hmm. D. Either his first name or his last name has a D. <laughs> I just saw it the other day. Actually, what did I do with that? Oh, it's upstairs. Uh, my daughter's friend, uh, mother, had an old soap opera magazine. Oh, aren't those are the best to look through? Yeah, she brought ones. it home. Actually, with a picture of her kind of like this, and the friend was like, what? That's so that? funny. Oh, that's um, but what's his name? He was such an adorable guy. He lives, in, he lives in Zuma. He's an artist. Lives in Zuma. Uh, oh, mm. Back, like, we always ask these show questions, but our, know, our own I, knowledge I, I of our, our show history is garbage. I run all the way upstairs so. and get the magazine. Yeah. That's but anyway, all right. That's um, all right. he's a really cool artist. Hold too. on. I have your Wikipedia page up. I bet I can find it. <laughs> <laughs> he's a really handsome guy. Really handsome guy. So he was yeah. my love interest for a while. Um, Ken Schreiner was my love interest for a while. Oh, Ken, yes. Yeah. And yes. Uh, that's the only bed scene I think I've done with somebody with a converse on. <laughs> but, Were they um, in the shot? Him. You know, the... he and I, we, our paths have crossed a million times. In, yeah. You know, like I said, on rituals. I, I, I mean, he, he tells me all the time what a huge star he was. <laughs> How, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know. I know he was. I know he yeah. was there in the beginning. Yeah, but that whole, was, so. that whole group, you know. Oh, uh, yeah. It's Billy amazing. Warlock, um, Ken, they're all uh -huh. like the little club, right? Sure. Back to um, Ken Schreiner. He's actually the one that kind of taught me this one thing because I would, we, there would, one day we had all these millions of scenes and I'm trying to get him to run them with me. And of course he didn't want to. And he, <laughs> he, he, he holds up the schedule and he, you know how it has everybody's, all your scenes listed. And yeah. like, you see this? This is the appetizer. And this is the salad. And this is the entree. And this is the dessert. We're only working on the appetizer right now. You know what I mean? He would, and I'm like, don't you want to run through the whole thing? Nope. Just the That's appetizer. So, so I got some good training from him. Yeah. Um, yeah. But uh, so who else was? Oh, then Stephen came on the show. Yeah, Stephen, right. Oh, right. That's, so did you get, you guys obviously crossed paths there. We were, we had a love interest thing. And then, and then I had a, a big affair with uh, Tyler Christopher. Oh, oh, yeah. And I think I, I, was, I, think I was his first uh, on-screen kiss. Oh. And, I, and at the time he was, uh, you know, 20 or something right. and i and i was uh i was probably in my early 30s and at the time i thought it was so old i said you call me mommy it's over <laughs> <laughs> anyway That's i adore funny. him and i know he's you know has had some struggles but yeah he's, he's awesome. such a sweetie pie he's yeah. great yeah and so i got to work with him again on um on days Right. With, did did Stephen oh, did right. the people at GH bring Stephen on because you were there? Like maybe like let's recreate some yes, of the. Actually, he. I, I, well, I'm gonna tell the story. I mean, he may not like the story, but um, he <laughs> had been unemployed, and I mean, he'd been doing some things, but he wasn't on a soap. And like I said, we all love these jobs. And I took him to the Emmys or something with me. And I'm telling you, the women, um, um, you know, um, executive producers were sort of fighting over him, and so they brought him to uh, GH. Awesome. Oh, that's amazing. 
Yeah. Yeah. And so it was great. But his character was so different. I don't, and my character, our characters were so different. It didn't work the same way it did. And then some it's, new writer came in and wrote us his brother and sister after we'd already been boyfriend and girlfriend. It was yeah, like, it's funky. Yeah. It's hard. It's hard to recapture. I know, I know daytime tries it all the time, but yeah. I mean, you can't recapture Patch and Kayla. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel.